all on. If y'all don't start commenting and sharing and subscribing, it's going to be me and y'all. Yeah. Stop playing with me. Comment. Hello, my fault. Go to the video. Hello. Bring some of that royalty. God, time is it? Alexa, what time is it? The time is 11.40 a.m. Oh, I've been working since 8 a.m. I don't feel like working no more. Baby, you wanna go out to eat? Sure. Alexa, turn my lights off. Okay. Yeah. What's up, y'all? So I know y'all could get valet, you know what I'm saying? You can go out to eat, get valet. That's cute. But can you do it anytime you want to? You dig what I'm saying? He about to open the door for you, baby. <laughs> Good, how are you? See y'all, I know y'all can go eat out wherever you please, right? But the question is, do you get paid for it? Do you get paid to live this lifestyle you wanna live? Cause I do. This meal is about to cost me about $200. I'm gonna get it back. That's the whole point. Get that check and get it right back. Need that. Uh. Mm. Mm -hmm. That's the one. Ah, let's taste the steak. Mmm. Oh, look at that. You can just dive right in. Let me uh, dip it over in. I'm gonna dip it over in. Mmm. Mmm. Mm. Now, let's not get anything misconstrued. Before I did any of that, I had to wake up early. I had to read a book to make sure I get my mind ready for the day. I had to meditate. I had to work out. I had to make sure I was prepared for the day also so I could prepare for my night when I live stream for y'all as well. Y'all listen, I'm not going to keep you long, but I want you to know that I'm starting Crown Creators Academy March 17th. That is the day that your lives can change. I just need you to sign up and hear me out. You dig what I'm saying? All I need is you. All I need is you. I got enough up here to supply you with whatever it is you need. Just give me a chance. I love y'all, man. See y'all March 17th. What's up, y'all? It's your girl, Neek G, the host. And today, I'm back with another reaction video. Before we go any further, make sure y'all like, comment, subscribe, and share this video. You dig what I'm saying? What the goddamn hell y'all league? So, crowncreatorsacademy.com, man. Y'all make sure y'all tap in. This is my personal academy to teach you all how to do YouTube, period. So, make sure you tap in. Get on that subscriber list. We are dropping this Friday. And yeah, man, that's it. That's all. It'll be in a pinned comment and the description. So this is my good sis again. Royalty says CJ So Cool is lying and shows proof. Neat response to King's video. Let's get it. <clears throat> video titled My Response About Co-Parenting. In the video, he addressed the main reason why Neat is going to be the main person taking Kaiser to school. Actually, to be honest with y'all, Kaiser original school, his first school, which is not even a school, it's a daycare. His first daycare school that he was going to was on the same side that I'm still living on. The, the way I was looking for homes and houses, I looked for homes and houses revolving around my kid's school, and I was revolving around just being in this area that I'm still in. She took the choice to move to the other side of the Houston and put his school well she was driving from her other side of the house to over here and it was like it was too far which it is it takes an hour to get to houston and it takes an hour to get back so going into that it was like vice versa she moved his school closer to hers his school is literally like 15 20 minutes the max 25 minutes the max is what his, how far his school is and that's not that bad but for me i was doing that with no problem for a year plus picking him up bringing him to school picking him up and it wasn't no problem for me until it started to be like, hey, bro, like, it's like gas money. It's like, it's a lot, bro. It's a lot because nobody didn't want to do it. She didn't want to do it. She, when she was living downtown, she didn't want to come way back here to pick him up, bring him to school because it was too far and it made sense. So the same thing for me, like, hey, can you move his school? I asked her plenty of times. Can you move his school closer in the middle? We already have a spot where we meet each other in the middle at like we meet in the middle to drop him off. Or sometimes I bring him all the way to her crib or she come way over here to pick him up or whatever the case may be. But like in general, like I asked her plenty of times to move his school closer because she have all his information. Like she have everything I can like, you know what I'm saying? She have all his information. You know what I'm saying? I asked her mom, whatever the case to get his information. She told me she was gonna give it to me and that's cool beans, but to this day I still don't have it. King also talks about how their co-parenting relationship has been going behind the scenes. I get talked to crazy, treated like this, then a third. I like make a passport without my consent of bringing my kids somewhere that I told you a year ago when you asked me like hey is it cool and I told you why because a cadre do not listen to nobody on that side so if you take him out the country and like 
God forbid or anything, he not listening to y'all and this, that, and anything was to happen. Like, I can't get on a 10 hour, 13 hour flight to go get my kid. It's like, I just, I'm not respected. I, I, I tell her that and I say this, I don't feel respected in this situation. And every time I, I say something, I be the bigger person, it's like, you know, I get this part behind closed doors and then I, it's like I wake up in the morning three months, two months down the line. I see something else about me on the media with the same situation or the same person. Me tweet responded to King's video. I really got a baby mama, LOL. Shit's weird. Lena. That's fucking terrible. Let me tell y'all something. <clears throat> As a man that's trying to take care of your child, I would take y'all baby mamas to court, period. And, and, and I mean, when I'm trying to to have a medium with you and you just not trying to have one with me at all. All right. And not only that, we could have probably went through that. That's cool. But you always got to put the shit on the Internet. No, man, because <laughs> I'm tired of you making me look like I'm a bad person. Neek bag is up. OK, her bag is up. Look at the difference in the pictures, bro. Look at her chain and her watch. Look at my boy necklace. I mean, look at his neck. My point is, she got a different type of bag right now than what he has right now, you know? So the thing is, and I get it, King made a, a, a decision that he shouldn't have made. He made some mistakes, da-da-da. Um, and I don't mean the cheating as a mistake. I mean, like, the whole Carmen thing was just absolutely a mess. It was, it was years ago. Like, she is, she is really, really making this boy life hell and i don't know if it's just karma or what but i'm not i'm not driving an hour and a half to go get my child from school when you want to have them all the way by your house a median is we can meet in the middle you need to go hey you'll go pick up cosmo hell yeah it's right there in the middle can you hey can you go pick cosmo in the middle hell yeah it's right there in the middle but you think i'm about to drive all the way over by your house every day for an hour now, him complaining about gas and shit like that, which goes back to Neek is living a total different life than King right now. You know what I'm saying? He he got a, he watching all his ducks. He got a, a whole family to take care of. And some of y'all may not care about that, but that's the problem. Women don't care about how these men feel. When you got a man who's really trying to be there, that's different. But what I will say is, King, if you on a birth certificate and all that, you can go get his social security card and... um. If she keep having an issue, man, take yourself to court. Y'all men need to learn to take yourself to court because you're not going to win, bro. The, when you're not in court, it's unfortunate. Women can do whatever the hell they want to do. But this is only to the men who are trying to actually work out with, you know, work shit out with their baby mom. Like, listen, put the boy school halfway. Let, let, let's do it like that. She say, no, I bet. You, her getting a passport for him. I think she's able to do ultimately she is the other parent as well if he ain't listening or whatever she could discipline him or do whatever it is she has to do now I don't know if this is a situation where anytime Kai's get in trouble she'd be like I'm about to call your daddy I don't know how that go because that's what it sound like but like I he can't stop her from going to Germany and letting you know Kaiser go to Germany he can't stop that you know what I'm saying if he went to court he could <laughs> You know, and say, all right, to the court, listen, I don't want my kid to go to Germany. I bet you're going to have to watch your kid more. You know what I'm saying? Because your, your, your baby mama got a man in Germany. It's a lot of drama with that baby mama, baby daddy shit. And if somebody don't take control of it, it's going to be all over the place. So it's best that, you know, men, if they just really want to be involved. Because you could tell when a man, and I'm telling y'all from experience, you could tell when a man really want to be involved and, and just really trying to help or really trying to do whatever he need. And then you could tell when a nigga just wolfing and want to control his baby mama. I done dealt with all of it. I'm telling you right now, if you ain't trying, if he ain't trying to control his baby mama, I ain't hear him saying shit about her. He just talking about the child. Like, listen, let's meet halfway. I don't want him going to Germany. Because he bad. He didn't say, I don't want him going to Germany because I don't want him to be around another man. That's not what he said. I don't want him to go to Germany because he bad. Anything happened, <clears throat> I can't hop on a 13th flight to come get my kid. You know what I'm saying? So, <sighs> it's a mess.
retweet what I love about the internet. They swear they be knowing what's going on. Nah, for real. When it comes to these type of situation involving kids, I just hope all parties can come together and make things work for the child. Y'all leave your comments down below when it comes to that. But let's talk about CJ So Cool because in his recent video, he said instead of giving royalty $6,000, something they agreed on in order for him to see his kids, he took that same $6,000 and paid a lawyer and him and royalty will be going to court soon. For those yeah. of you in the comments saying that she's holding the kids away from me because the CPS were called, that's false. She was already holding the kids away from me before the CPS was called. Hell, she was holding the kids away from me before Christmas. It's just that I was able to keep paying her to get the kids. And now it's to a point where I feel like I shouldn't have to keep paying every time I want to see the kids. I should. Yeah, p paying to see your kids every single time to see your kids is blasphemy. You <laughs> have to pay $2,000 yeah, to her. see the kids. Well, <laughs> if I didn't pay you last month because I didn't see the kids at all, now I owe you double because I shouldn't have to do all that. First of all, <laughs> you have money. You're living your life. You're going out of town. You're going on trips. You're going to clubs. You're, you're doing a lot. You're selling pictures. You're selling seminars. You have money. So by you, not only that, you said I was broke. So let's just get that out the way. You said I don't have anything, so why do you want something from me, the person that doesn't have anything? I don't know, right? So long story short, you guys were always in the comment section saying it was my fault that I don't get to see my kids, and it's my fault that things are being handled professionally, and that I needed to go see- Because it is. Because you talk too much, but okay. Counsel, I need to go get a lawyer. I need to go get a mediator. It's always me, right? I got to take the high road. So guess what? I took the high road finally, and I decided to listen to you guys. And not yeah. only you guys, but to listen to my ex, because even she said in her own videos that if I wanted to see my kids, I know what to do. She's ready for war in court, blah, blah, blah. I don't want to go to war. I don't want to fight. I don't want to do any of that. I just want to see my kids. So that being said, um, I asked her to see my kids, and I let her know I'll do as I always do, give you money, whatever it takes. And she finally responded, and she was like, uh, well, you owe me $6,000. So give me six thousand dollars and we can meet in the parking lot at Walmart. You can take pictures. And with then your kids. I'm giving you six thousand dollars to meet in a parking lot at Walmart. And granted, I wouldn't want them kids at that house either. But royalty is at the top of the line, Petty. Like she is pimping that nigga to see his own kids. <laughs> I ain't mad at a boy, but she hell, he, she can't do that. But you can't take not home. just that's like, great <laughs> and then two thousand dollars oh i want to see my kids all right bet you send me the cash app of two thousand dollars every time girl you tripping something ain't right <laughs> so i hit her again like are you sure like so how does this happen i give you the six thousand dollars then what she's like okay we can take the kids somewhere we don't even get along so why would she want to do something with me i, I don't agree know. She with hates that my guts i agree she hates with my that shoes she hates the fact that i'm moving on she hates the business she hates my girlfriend she hates white people she hates way too many things that i like but like i said i reached out to an attorney i paid thousands of dollars right it was either two options give her the six thousand dollars and meet them in walmart parking lot take some pictures with the twins to soothe the pain of not seeing them for three months straight or take that same $6,000, give it to an attorney, have her draft up a letter, putting all the law in there and send it to her. That's what I did. Now in CJ So Cool video, he said royalty is not allowing him to see the kids unless he gives her $6,000. Now royalty put up That's some messages crazy. accusing CJ So Cool of lying. Now in <clears throat> he gives her $6,000. Now royalty put up what can we do to start co-parenting? I need to see the twins. It's been months and it's long overdue for the kids to see me. So set a day, place, and time for me to meet so I can see the kids. Please, I'll pay you whatever to see my kids if that's what it takes. The last time I gave you money was the end of December. That was 2K. So are you saying I have to give you 6K to see my kids in a parking lot for a few minutes? Because I was confused when you said I can't take them to my house. Not royalty deleting her messages. Or oh, they was on the phone put up some messages accusing CJ So Cool of lying. Now, in his video, he mm. said that royalty was only going to allow him to see his she kids deleted and messages. he paid her $6,000 and they agreed upon that. But royalty put up some messages showing He's that responding back to what she said. I will say that, that, that about royalty, to make herself look like she's the winner on the internet, she will go a little low, a, a lot of low. And that, he, 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 <laughs> Yeah, he knew who she was before he even had a child, and she knew who he was before they she had them babies. Girl, this a mess. I see you aren't going to respond to me or my attorney, so I scheduled an appointment with with a counselor to talk with us both, so we can finally hear each other and figure all this out. Ah. Uh? 
Now, she can't not respond to the attorney child for she get a... They going to meet her ass somewhere while she out eating and go get served some papers. That she never responded back to him when he offered her the $6,000. What can we do to start co-parenting? I need to see the twins. It's been months. It's a long overdue for the kids to see me. So set a day, place, and time for me to meet so I can see the kids. Please, I'll pay you whatever to see my kids if that's what it takes. The last time I gave you money was the end of December. That was $2,000. So you are saying I have to give you $6,000 to see my kids in a parking lot for a few minutes? Because I was confused when you said i can't take them to my house i see you aren't going to respond. why was you confused that she said that you can't take them to the house don't be confused you got shot four times in there and see i see what royalty's coming from and i also see his side he want to see his damn kids you know um so but royalty tired of him talking about her which she need to send that nigga a cease and desist asap and um he wouldn't be able to talk about me no more you know what i'm saying like that, I will put some money into that, but oh God, that's a mess. Find to be on my attorney, so I scheduled an appointment with the counselor to talk with us both so we can finally hear each other out and figure this all out. What's a counselor going to do? So the counselor is someone that tries to mediate the situation before you see the judge. Hopefully y'all can work things out, put it on paper, get it notarized, and that's y'all agreement. Now, if someone breaks that agreement, they can actually go see the judge. And once the judge step in, then you have to do that or you're going to get fined or go to jail. So the counselor is like the pre-step before the judge. Now let's talk about royalty and D-Lo because they're now having public disagreements in my pre Previous video, Royalty said some things on a live that rubbed D Lo the wrong way. Wait, and he's what? now speaking. In my previous video, I'm smoking you tomorrow on video. Pick on somebody your own size. I love the kids, but you asked for this. Video, Royalty said some things on a live that rubbed D Lo the wrong way. And he's now speaking on it. The link to that video is down below. Cynia drops another video with new dude. I explained everything in my previous video. The link is down below. Congratulations to Kai for winning Stream of the Year Award. He wasn't present at the award, so Chris and Agent had to accept his award. Oh, again? Oh, my God, y'all done did it again. You feel what I'm saying? I want to go ahead and thank God first before anything. Um, thank my family, thanks to my friend, thanks to everybody who helped me with this whole thing. I just want to say I appreciate everybody who's casting a vote for me to win this year. <laughs> and I just want to say- Tell them A&P boys some real friends, boy. They some good friends, man. Yeah, I'm more for ready real. to work than ever. You feel what I'm saying? I appreciate everybody who supported me in any little, big, any type of way, any type of way. I just want to say, um, I love everybody. You feel me? Hope you guys are having a great night, and uh, I'll see y'all soon. Yes, sir. Queen Aja did change the screen save on her phone life. after Clarence points out that she had her picture instead of his picture on her phone and he had her picture on his phone. I didn't even know this was a big deal. Y'all comment <laughs> down below. Is this a big deal in your relationship? Are you upset that your partner doesn't have you on their phone? Now y'all comment that below. Let me know what y'all thinking. Until next time, peace. Because one day I looked at his phone. I was like, oh, let me put him as my screen saver too, right? <laughs> And literally, I will get distracted. No, no, my age. We sat there and talked about that damn screensaver and, and him on that screen. Listen, she talked about that for a long time. I watched it. Listen, y'all. Um, hopefully, they get that together. CrowdCreatorsAcademy.com. Please, y'all tap in. I'm teaching everybody how to do YouTube, set everything up, whatever it is. If you want to set up streaming, reactions, uh, anything, I know how to do it. You know what I'm saying? So just let me know. Love y'all. Appreciate y'all. Hell yeah.